Hello, hello there, and welcome back to War Thunder. Welcome to the new patch, and welcome aboard the SMS Spion. So, this video is sadly not so much about the ship's capabilities, rather than uh, Gaijin's way of dealing with things. Um, the Ban's a great ship, um, the second biggest guns in the game with uh, 15 inch or 380 millimeter guns technically just a little bit smaller than the hoods 381 millimeters but hey who's counting and i just got set on fire from c via spokoini with its 130 millimeter guns i tried to extinguish the fire but i blow up uh four kilometers distance so yeah seems like we have a little bit of a problem here the armor doesn't seem to work Next thing is that this might have just been a fluke. Maybe I was unlucky. So this is what I uh, thought was receiving a salvo from the Bayern, but actually it uh, seemed to be something else. He was actually shooting the Helena, but I took some serious damage from over there. And I was thinking, yeah, that must have been the Bayern. So um, I hit him as well. Now with my sap shells, which are frighteningly good, uh, most of the time. I also have great secondaries and I have a lot of torpedoes and I would love to use those torpedoes. The problem is it's not that Bayern shooting me. So who is? Believe it or not, uh, you might have briefly seen that cruiser bow in stationary at long range. That's a Russian cruiser at more than nine kilometers. Here is he on the right hand side of the picture. And I think to myself, yeah, I, ca I can ignore a light cruiser, right? I'm in a super dreadnought, right? Again, big damage to the Bayern. That was a little bit of a lag, and the Chapayev killed me. Okay. Um, what the hell? What's going on? Now, you might say, maybe, maybe the Bayern is bugged. Maybe the Bayern is really uh, just like the uh, SMS kaiser at its introduction where it just blew up despite having impressive armor array yeah you might think that so here i hit the Hugo with well secondaries and main battery and then i'm a little bit more in the back and i release a salvo of secondaries eight 15 centimeter sap shells and then afterwards i shoot the red tracer main battery sap shells but I blow him up, just seemingly hitting nowhere important with the secondaries. And that's really weird. And then I get blown up by a Graf Spee with its 11 inch guns at a rather significant distance. Okay, um, seems like we're really having fun. So next clip is again here killing uh, Zelensnyakov after multiple salvos and I just wanted to try out my torpedoes because I have so many of them, they are really large caliber and for World War 1 torpedoes they ain't all that bad. There is a clueless Scharnhorst, now that is a dangerous business so I don't shoot him. I don't shoot him and I concentrate here on the enemy cruiser. I see that there is also a destroyer coming relatively close. I'm leading the charge with a great portion of my team right behind me. We just want to push the enemy team um, out of this cap, try to win it. Uh, believe it or not, this is not the worst map design in the game. Open motion might be the most balanced one. It doesn't really help if you fight there with destroyers versus uh, heavy cruisers or with anything superior uh, versus something even more superior. So again, multiple bugs. First of all, the hit cam on the cruiser stays on for way too long. The main batteries get released way before they actually turn around and I get a bomb into my stern. Um, I have to concentrate here on the flooding because it's severe as you see it. Uh, 75, 70% uh, and I blow up. So fires are also really dangerous. You will not believe the uh, other example. So um, this is a Kronstadt. The Kronstadt does not have sap. The Kronstadt has much smaller caliber. I was perfectly angled at 45 degrees and still getting one shot. 
So is the armor not working or are the shells overperforming? Now, this is really great because I just shot the HMS hood and hit it with multiple shells in the middle of the ship. Uh, and he hit the front also with multiple shells. Now, interestingly enough, the hood goes down. I get a kill assist for it, despite being a kill of mine. Another bug, by the way. And that fire, where I receive serious damage, I can extinguish. And I can deal with the flooding, repair everything, etc, etc. And I'm like, what? Okay, tough ship. But then I get killed by an HMS London, while even more angled. Let's have a look at what the London actually fires from its 8-inch guns. Yes, it has at 10 kilometers 153 millimeters of pen. He was at 9 kilometers. The weakest plating here is 170 millimeters. Look at the angling it was, and those were the shells that killed me. This is frustrating. Then there is also this plane. Didn't release the bombs. Watch this. There was no bomb symbol, there was nothing. Uh, I just received damage around the front ammo rack and as if I would have been hit by bombs, but there weren't any. So what the hell killed me? There is no information. It doesn't make sense. So here again, I then get re, uh, really hit hard by 12 inch whatever shells, try to deal with the fire, you know, um, really focused on it and I'm just about to um, deal with it. Three seconds before it uh, actually gets done, I get killed. Wow! There you can see in the screenshot the plane had till the very end all the bombs attached. Uh, it makes no sense. You can watch that scene over and over again. The hit marker getting berserk. It was definitely not a bomb explosion. I have no clue what's going on. And this is just outright frustrating. And so I will not touch the Bayern again till this is fixed. And this might take a very long time because the feedback from the Gaijin CC Discord was, yeah, basically everything can kill everything. Yeah, but there are numbers of armor plating and of shells. And if we throw this out of the one uh, out of the window, I can play, I don't know, a KV2 all day long and just be amazed how good the game works. This is not acceptable, this is not the basis of any sort of argumentation, and I'm really lost for any more words. And sadly, that's the best that I can show you, because I've spent hours upon hours of trying, but uh, this was repeatedly a problem, and I also spent quite the time to give feedback, which was just thrown out of the window, apparently. And this is not how I can do proper videos that are fun to watch. I'm absolutely sorry guys but let me know in the comment section what you think about this is this really absolutely broken is this how it's supposed to be in your opinion uh what are your experiences if you are uh, a captain i just don't know what's going on at the end of the day that is the result if you don't have quality control and if you create all the power creep and feature creep and can't handle it and that's it for me today so thanks for watching thanks for listening you know where to like subscribe and also how to share this video and see you on the waves of war thunder next time